So once again, I wake up this morning chanting, how low can you go? How low can you go? And uh, just a really good feeling. Now I have friends who tell me that they're trying to not look at their 401ks or their whatever accounts. And if you're prone to panic selling, that might be some good advice. I'm not. I'm, I'm actually panic buying right now. Now to give you an idea of uh, how I came up with the idea of how low can you go, at the beginning of the pandemic in March 2020, you see, I've, I've had 401ks at multiple jobs that I've transferred into an IRA account uh, because I have much more options there and I have a lot of mining stocks and um, emerging market stocks. And back in 2019, late 2019, early 2020, metals had already started to recover from their slumps uh, in the decade of the 20 teens. And I thought my time for buying mining stocks and precious metals was over. And it was kind of depressing for me, actually, because I, I, I've been wanting to stack more before everything blows up, right? I suspect this precious metals market is going to end in a short squeeze. I really do. But I want more time to do that, to, to, to load up. Not only because I want more time to load up, but also because I'm not quite ready to get wealthy just yet. There are some things in my life I want to square away. I want to have the right life connections. If I wake up tomorrow and I'm a multimillionaire, it's going to cause a lot more problems than it solves right now because I don't have the right connections just yet. So anyways, I, I was depressed in late 19, early 20 because I thought those days of stacking are over. And then we all know what happened in March and I looked and everything had crashed and I was in disbelief actually. It was very abstract. It was on a computer screen that the Dow was 19,000 and silver was $12 an ounce. It seemed very abstract until I opened uh, my IRA account and I saw this really beautiful negative six digit number. It was really beautiful. A lot of people would panic if they saw that. But to me, that represented more time. And uh, I had just gotten my uh, bonus at work. I hadn't touched it yet, and I used it to buy, among other things, a thousand ounce silver bar and to load up on my IRA contributions for the year. And uh, it was one of the most beautiful things I ever saw. Now, fast forward a year later during the GameStop squeeze, silver hit $30 an ounce and other things are up too and i go back to my ira account now it's a positive six digit number and that was that was saddening that really was my time was running short now fast forward another year and um russia's invasion on ukraine it's still unfortunately it's still a positive number but now it's only five digits that's real beautiful real beautiful to see how low can you go how low can you go how low can you go how low can you go?